Water. Water. Thanks for going with me this morning. Appreciate you out. Well, you know. Appreciate you just coming along for the ride. What's up? You want me to sit down there? Well, let's go get in the pool. I'm mm. going to go get in the pool. Well, then you stay here. Can I get in the pool? All right. Bye. See you. I'm going over here. Why don't you come on over here? Come on. Apparently, Abigail was up all night last night. I have no idea. I wasn't. You were sound asleep. <laughs> so this morning, I was like, why don't you go with me? I got to go work on the camper. She went with me. Let mom take a little a little snooze because she was I was up early. She was up early. She's raring to go. She was good though. She chilled. I turned the music on in the camper, you know. Yeah. She had her iPad. She's just hanging out. So yeah, she, yeah. She keeps going back to her room, hanging out in the bed. So because of TikTok, we decided there's nothing wrong with Sandy. <laughs> she is the way that she is because of the breed that she is. I've never. Seen Let me know another. if you guys have a golden because apparently they're all the same. Like they're the same goofy. <laughs> You know, <laughs> not just getting balls and, you know, balls that won't fit in their mouth in a pool, but <laughs> the laying upside down, the falling off of things all the time, tripping, sliding on the pool deck, falling downstairs. Giving you her paw. Yeah, always with the paw. She's always, ugh. I've never seen a breed like that, though, that's so similar. Like, Where all the dogs are the same? Yeah, like they look the same. Yeah, I think they have a shallow breeding pool. That's what it is. <laughs> hey, Ab, you want to come get in the pool? Abby. You want to swim? No. Come on, you're going to want to do it later when it's dark. You know that. You'll be like, you know what, guys? Changed my mind six hours later. We're trying to get as much pool time in as we can before we leave. That's the goal. And and family time. we got family dinner tonight. Are you ready for mom's cooking? Yes. Come on. Let's go. You want to go eat? No? Okay. So yourself. Thank you for joining us for the evening meal. Have a fantastic, safe ride home. Thanks for having us. Good evening. I hope you're Good fine. Evening. Dramatic zoom in. That was the best outro I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> These are the days that stress me out. I told Priscilla I have not vlogged really, not much. I'm just what you guys have seen. In two days, like three days. Like I didn't have a very long vlog the other day either. I always pull out a video though, you know? Okay, finishing this vlog tomorrow. Girl. Half of the day is gone. What's that face? Is it taste bad? It's just a pill. Here. Follow it. You need a little drink? Yeah. <coughs> Cover your mouth. Go like this. Go like this. Mm -hmm. <coughs> like that. <coughs> drink it. You gotta, you gotta drink it after your pills. Your uh, possible potential new teacher. Hey, I'm speaking to you. Oh, yeah, finish yourself, my bad. Your potential possible new teacher shows up in a few minutes. Are you excited? What do you think of that? Can you get your stuff? Put it in the trash. I mean, I can do coffee. Yeah. How about you? I need coffee in my life. I had like a cup and a half. I feel like it's just not enough. Not enough. We didn't wake up till 11.30. Isn't that crazy? Not we, you, I mean. I was gonna say. <laughs> Mom woke up at like 5 a.m. to take the dogs to get them groomed. I don't know why that was such an early thing. Not really, but you woke up at what? 7.30, 8 o'clock? 7.30. Yeah. And Isaiah was up That's too. That's crazy. Yeah, Isaiah had to go to an internship. I mean, it's not crazy to get up at 7.30. It's crazy to get up at 7.30 to take the dogs to get groomed. <laughs> And then there might be one day where she helps with the laundry. That's not an everyday task, but then we would break it down because we have laminator, we have Velcro, we have everything. Okay. Um, so we're fully prepared uh -huh. to make that stuff. But I know you're very capable of washing dishes. So you're going to help mom. Yeah. And we'll come up with a little routine. So after and we'll give you updates as far as what we're working on over the summer. Yeah. And then, you know, you can... Um, and then we'll just kind of communicate through the summer on like what, um, you know, what kind of routine and schedule we can create for when we get home. Right. And this is always a good start for any relationship I have as a couch buddy. That's you know? right. It's a great way to start. Yep. Get out of the house for a little bit. Huh? Uh, a good plan? Uh, what is, what is uh, it? Uh, there you go. Girl, fix yourself. 
There you go. What's that face? Don't make that face. You want some sunglasses? There you go. Put those on. Put them on. Oh, on top of the head, I like I like that look. Here, let's see. Look at this. It's styling. We get questions all the time about, um, you know, are we going to add whatever to Abby's iPad? Like different sections, that kind of thing. Um, different words. And I want to show you guys, this is what she was on while we were sitting here at lunch. She was in the about me section. So this is all, it's all preloaded with stuff like that. Like it's like, do you know where I live? I live in blank. Great talk. Interesting. Not listening. Like it's all... It's all categorized in different areas and then subcategorized into other areas. So people always are asking, like, you know, why don't you add this word or that word? It's in there. I right? like it's genuinely in there. And then if we can't find a word, oftentimes she'll find it before we will. And if we can't find a word, we can search for it. So trippy ceilings. Here, you can have that bag, you can talk. Okay, so I'm trying to remember all the things that you guys ask about Abby's communication device. There's also the option to type words on here. Um, some people have said, you know, she needs to be able to type. Well, she can't type. She would have to learn how to type first, huh? Yeah, we have to learn how to type. We don't know how to type. Um, typing requires spelling. What's up? Water. You need something to drink? Okay, I'll get you some. But that app does include that. And I will put a link down in the video description for TD Snap, her app, as well as what device she uses the app on, uh, so that you guys can find it easier for those looking. But it works really well, and it's highly customizable, and that's and that's why we like it. It's customizable to fit. You know, not everyone has the same communication level. Like, not everybody can type, or not everybody is going to use every word on a device. Because you know, and a lot of times, like, because she doesn't want to. She doesn't want to say those. She's going to say what she wants to say. Especially if she has access to all categories and all words. And she doesn't utilize them. You know, there's a level of understanding. But then there's also just not wanting to. You going with mom? Are you? Hold on. Are you going? Hold on. Hold on. Are you going with mom? Okay. Bye. This bump. Hello. See you later. Love you. Thumbs up. Nice. Just straight sweating. It's not even hot, it's just humid. It's, well, I mean, it's raining, so it's 100% humidity, but the dog hammock is in. We have two places for the dogs. In the back, I got fans set up to blow the AC back there. But it doesn't mean we're kicking them out of the cab. So we got this big old dog hammock in here. So they have all that area, and Abby still has her area over there. Or we can put the dogs in the back. And Abby has the whole, I mean, not like she uses more than her seat, but you know what I'm saying. So, perfect. So this will be Abby's view for the trip. So for the driving part. Not bad. Not a bad little setup right here. With her doggos right there. All of her stuff and things. This does unzip right here. Um, it actually is beneficial because... Abigail has her drink cup, but she's got this OCD thing where she can't leave her cup in the cup holder. She has to put it on the floor all the time. Well, of course, then her cup spills and then she doesn't have anything to drink. So this will be nice having it there um, because we, that still allows us to use a cup holder. But yeah. Oh, also another thing. She doesn't have... A lot of times, accidentally, she'll hit the seat heater. So that's going to mitigate that a good bit. It's not really designed for that, obviously. It's designed to keep the, the doggos from slobbering your elbows every chance they get, and Sandy does do that. Now, the other option here is we can lay this seat down and put the cover over top of the seat, and that makes it like a double-decker. So you'd have area on the floor and area on the seat for the dogs to lie, so they lie separate from each other. Maverick prefers, like, the deepest, darkest hole when he's traveling. Like, he likes to be, like, wedge himself under the seat and just, like, lay there. Sandy wants to be up and about and see the world. So that's probably what we'll end up doing most of the time. We did that a lot for the last trip. Speak of the devil. And the only reason I tell you all this is because we had 9,000 questions about where the dogs rode on the trip. So, hi, guys. Oh my goodness, what happened to Sandy? Uh, what did they do? Hold on. Hold on, Sandy. Let Maverick come out first. 
Come on, Maverick. Maverick, oh no. No, why did they do that to you? Sandy, you look stupid. What did they do? Why did they do that? I don't know. She's a golden retriever. I said, this morning I said, she said, how do you want them cut? And I said, you know, I want them cut so that they're not like shedding so bad. We need a deep for V shed. And she said, okay. And I said, but the traditional golden cut. And she's like, well, goldens don't have a traditional cut. Golden retrievers don't have a typical look, huh? They don't have it like a typical hairdo I know. that's common to golden retrievers. I'm legitimately upset. What, why would they leave his tail like that? Maverick. Hers too. They, oh. And he's a flat-coated retriever. Like, that's... This is your fault. You went to a different groomer. <laughs> They're still so cute. Look at them. These, I feel like they need clothes. <laughs> you look naked. <laughs> is the end of your tail heavy? Isaiah. My reaction exactly. Sue. <laughs> Sandy. Maverick. Would you take him to a poodle grimmer? <laughs> what? Oh my god, Maverick. Why would they do that to you? What's wrong with his tail? Why is it. <laughs> what? He's got an allergy to the pollen, which he gets every year, which we have meds for, but they didn't have to do that to the guy. Like they... Who did this? I'm so... If what? I don't laugh, I'm just gonna cry. Why do they look like a Dr. Seuss book? That's what I want to know right now. That I wanted their hair short, like not a trim and tidy. Like they've been getting trim and tidies, right. but they only last like a week. Yeah, it's... So it's... I said I wanted to get them cut, but I didn't really want to like, shave them. Sandy, what'd they do to you? Your ears have more hair than the rest of your body. Oh It'll grow back. Gosh. You're so soft, I'm but... just... I'm just disappointed that we're leaving so soon and we have to take you out, not just out in public, but around the whole country looking like this. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry that they did this to you. Mom didn't know, okay? She didn't do this on purpose. It's not her it's fault. It's the tails that get me, though. <laughs> what yeah, happened? Literally, are you stupid? Like, like, did, did your you... clipper batteries run out? Right? What happened there? That's a good looking tail, Sandy. That is a... Yeah, it's a gorgeous tail for you. Look. Look at this. <laughs> Mavericks is worse. Mavericks. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, buddy. Why did they leave just the tip oh, on it? Looks like, like he went to the gym. <laughs> and there's only one pound between the two of them. Huh? One pound difference. Yeah. She's 66 it's okay, point Mav. something. He's 68. It's okay, buddy. Look, she can't stand it. It's like something is oh, missing. I'm sorry. What is this? You look like, you think like you have a little, a little duster. <laughs> I think the problem is that Priscilla said don't shave them. Like specifically said don't shave them. It's okay, sweetie. <laughs> this, it'll, it'll grow back. I see his it's so, I'm so sad for him. It, just... It'll grow back. We'll just take you out at night at the dog parks and stuff. It's, it's no big deal. I think you like, know what kind of breed she is. It'd be like, also, it'd be like if I just was like, mm, I'm going to shave right here on my arm. Just right here. Like, they have that going on on the back of their legs for some reason. She's like, I got to make sure their joints are exposed so that they can more easily walk around. Like, there's a, what is that? What is that trim? What is it? I was like, what happened to my say, other and Say, those are racing stripes. Yeah, like, that's for efficiency in the water or what? You know what? You're still so cute. You're still so cute. Oh my goodness. No, All right. Know? This this vlog just don't touch my daughter. Keep her away. Keep her away. This, this vlog just fell off the roof. Alright. Was this about original? I have no idea. We'll oh. see you guys tomorrow. Bye.